Hey everybody, the horse racing kid is signing on. The handicap races from Dubai Racing from Maidan Race Course here on Thursday, February the 18th, 2010. I'm going to handicap all the races from race number 2 to race number 8. Give me some help with all the races. Uh, last week at Maidan, I had a, one of my best days in Dubai since I'm handicapping Dubai for maybe the past uh, maybe past 9 years I'm doing Dubai picks since I'm uh, really little. Uh, so last week was my best day ever in like nine years at Dubai doing Dubai racing. I'm gonna handicap it again and tomorrow for you. Race number two from Dubai from Maidan is the Nafid sponsored by Shadwell Estate going a beat six furlongs purse hundred ten thousand dollars for northern hemisphere breads, four year olds, southern, three year olds. And uh and I'm going with the three here in this field of sixteen. Please note 13 through 16 also eligible. So I'm going with number three, Mess Masunsuku Patrick Smullian. Last time out, did run at Maidan six furlongs at a bay, came in tenth. Then ran at Wolverhampton five furlongs back in the UK back in January the 17th. Uh, won by half a length. It was a very good horse then that day. Sorry. So yeah, I like what that horse did on the synthetic. This horse is 27 and 8th over the synthetic. I think this horse should handle it. So to recap my bets for race number 2 from Maidan Dubai Racing, I like the 3. Race number 3 from Dubai from Maidan is a not close sponsored by Shadwell Estate. Going at the distance of a purse, going at the distance of a beat mile 3 8 uh, Their uh, purse $110,000 for Northern Hemisphere Breads. Four year olds enough, which uh, four year olds, southern, three year olds enough. I'm going with the four in this race in this field of 17. Four, 15 through 17 are are also eligible. Are also boy, and I'm going with the four. Monte Alto, Richard Hills. Last time out, the run up made on a mile three eighths over the over the artificial stuff. Came in second, then ran uh, made on again mile three eighths. Came in third, second at Maidan. Jebel Ali came third on the dirt, on the sand, whatever it is there. On uh, Abu Dubu, uh, whatever it is. I, I have no idea what it's called. I came up with a name. Ran a mile three eights twice on the turf. Came in third and one. Synthetics three and oh, but two seconds. Loves the Maidan surface. Came in the money on the Maidan surface at four, eight to one. This is my best bet of the day. So we can't my bet race number three from uh, Maidan Dubai Racing like the four. Race number Four from Dubai is the Ahmed Al Al Clam sponsored by Shadwell Estate going to be at six furlongs. Hundred fifty thousand is the purse. Uh, Northern Hemisphere breads four year olds, Southern three year olds and up. And I'm going with the five here in this field of uh, fifteen fifteen main track. Oh, uh, is also eligible. Number five doors Echo Richard Mullen. Last time out, the run up made on last week. No, two weeks ago, actually, in the handicap race, came in third by two and a quarter lengths. Uh, then ran it was a good start. Then ran at Saratoga six prongs in Al Albert Vanderbilt back in 08. Came in fourth and fourth in the True North handicap, and then ran it in the Shahina Classic at six prongs back in 07. Uh, ran the Golden Sh Shaheen, came in sixth and sixth in the prep for that race. This is the horse that won the Brewers Cup Classic in 2006. One of my favorite horses. I picked that horse in 2007. And then this horse did win a race at Lower. Won the De Francis Dash. But won three quarter lengths before it being purchased by Godolphin. So yeah. So recap my bets for race number four from Maidan Dubai Racing Race to five. Race number five from Dubai is the Naviv. The Najiv, sponsored by Shadwell Estate, going to be at 7 for 175,000. This first Northern Hemisphere Breds, 4 year olds, 3 year olds, 4. 3 enough for Southern. And I'm going with the 6 here. Number 6, Atomic Green, an American horse. Less uh, Godolphin owns Sabe and Sierra Trains. And M Michael Barcelona is a jockey. Last time out, they were in the Haskell. 1.2 million Haskell. Came in 6. That was on the soft. They ran in the fast. They ran in, in the long branch at Monmouth. Won and won a lounge race at Monmouth. Came 16th in the Derby. 
fourth in the Wood Memorial and Lounge Race down at Goldstream came in third. I really like this horse, 11 and 3. Let's see how we'll handle the, the artificial stuff. So you can have my bets for race number 5 from uh, made on Dubai Racing Life to 6. Race number 6 from Dubai is the UAE Guineas, sponsored by Shadwell Estate. Going to be tomorrow, grade 3, 250 is the purse. 250,000 is the purse. And I'm going with the 4 here in this field, the 17. Number 4, Della Barra, uh, a chili, Chilean bread. Last time out, they run in uh, HC8. Uh, ran a race set at 7.5 furlongs on the dirt. Came in second. Then won a race at 6.5. Third in a race at, at in uh, Chile, and third and second race at Chile. First time over the artificial stuff here. I'm going with this one. Oli, Oli, Oliver Fessler is a jockey, so I think I'm going with this one. So recap my bets for race number six from Dubai Racing. From mid on, I like the four. Race number seven is the second round of the Al Maktoum Challenge, sponsored by Shadwell Estate. Going a mile on three sixteenths, and I'm going with. The 8 here in this field, the 12. Number 8, Jali, Frankie Dettori. Last time out, they were at Nato Shiba at a bit of mile. Came in 7. They were at Nato Shiba again a mile in 8th. In this, came in 12th. That was last year. They were at Suffolk Downs here in America in a stake race. Came in 3rd. Was was the heavy, heavy favorite that day. And then we're in a stake race at Nato Shiba. Mile in the Dubai World. <gasps> Cup against Curlin, came seventh behind Curlin, won the prep for the World Cup, and won a other race before the Dubai World Cup. Going with this one, I think this one should be good, so I have my best for race. Number seven from Maidan Dubai Racing, the Al Maktoum Round 2 Challenge. I'm going with the eight. Race number eight from Dubai is the Maktoum, sponsored by Shadwell Estate, a beat a mile, and I'm going with the 812 here exactly. Let's start with number eight. Number eight, Baf Balcare No. Jamie Spencer. Last time out, they were not made on a beat them all. One by five lengths. Then we're at Wolverhampton Lounge Race. Came in third. Eighth at Newmarket. Sixteenth at Newmarket. Second at Doncaster. And fifth at York. Uh, this was a hard race for me. I am picked this horse because he ran twice on the synthetic stuff. I don't like the. I don't like the. Horses who didn't go on the tur uh, turf to synthetic, so I just don't, they don't win for me. I'm going with number 12, Sylvia and three, three many. Last time out, the run in Maidan Mile came in third. May, uh, then at Lengthfield in Mile 70 came in sixth. Won a race on the synthetic stuff, so yeah, I'm going with this one. So, cap my bets for race number eight from Dubai Racing. I like the 812 exacta. So, it's the horse racing kids signing off. Remember, good luck.